consult and follow all local building codes before installing next stone siding and accessories. Window and door wall penetrations must be properly sealed and flashed if necessary. Next stone window and door trim is a decorative trim only. It is not designed to channel water. Window and door trim is designed to be used in a variety of ways. Of course, for trimming windows and doors. For use as a transition at the end of panel runs. Or it can be used decoratively to cap wall to ceiling transitions. Rip down the trim pieces for special applications, such as covering construction transitions. Or modify the pieces to trim out existing windows or any gaps that need filling. Next stone panels are designed to slide behind the window and door trim pieces. You would usually install window and door trim before installing panels. Here we are installing rows of panels between window trims so it is easier to remove one trim and reinstall it after all the panels are in place. If running panels up to a ceiling or soffit, it may be easier to install the trim after installing the panels. In these cases, measure the space needed for the trim to fit and install after the panels. Most cuts can be done on a miter saw. Extreme cuts may require a table saw. Use our next stone touch-up paint to cover the exposed ends of the cut pieces. Slide the pieces into place. Secure the pieces as per the instructions. Caulk and paint the screw heads as demonstrated later. Use a table saw to rip down trim pieces to fit almost any application. Here, we have ripped down the back edge and notched the top to trim out between two existing windows. In this installation, the back of the trim was completely ripped down on a table saw, and the back edge trimmed down to fit between the installed window and outside brick. To hide the fasteners, Make sure all screw heads are set deeply enough for the caulk to stick in place. Smooth the caulk out from the screw head, blending the texture over the surrounding surface. Use Nextone touch-up paint to cover the caulk. Feather the paint out from the center of the caulk to blend it into the surrounding surface. We hope you found this video helpful. Please check out the Nextone classroom at nextone.com for more installation videos.